Like there were certain things that like influenced or like made an impact on like what your sense of humor was. So like for me, that was stuff like Ali G and Borat. Um, pretty much anything Sasha Hot Baron Cohen paladins did. paladins in your area. I would come in here and tell a Borat joke. Dude. Probably get you banned. Dude, what is up? What's up? Chat, ah. it's Asmongold. What's up, boys? How y'all nice. doing? Dude, I was just gonna tell you I have a bounty. Can you please come over? Yeah, yeah, sure. Which one? <laughs> uh, I have to shop at American Eagle for 15 minutes. That's my favorite, favorite it's the store. Best, it's the best store for I, 15 I mean, minutes. Eagles are the best, so are Americans, right? I also haven't formed enough views to start shopping. Oh, now. right, of course. Yeah. So yeah, I started reacting. Yeah, of course. All right, yeah. what are you reacting to? I'm reacting to Ali G. Actually, check this, this out. Is this the, this is the top, dude. Ali G was so good. Mm-hmm. I, I really cannot even express how good this was. All right, that's different. Naked woman uh, on a hole. That's different. That is different. Uh, <clears throat> so, anyway, um, it was just a drawing with no details, Chad. It's okay. Um, <sighs> well, at least she wasn't sucking the horse's dick. Yeah, that would be bad. It's fine, Chad. I just didn't want to go any further. Um, I have to get my food. It took me an hour to drive over here because it turns out that driving over at like 4.30 on a fucking Friday is, is oh my God, it took forever, man. It was insane. You can want me to get up there? No, can you relax just right there? Uh, say what? Say the thing. Oh. Sup, Asmund, how you doing, bro? Sup, y'all, it's me, it's your boy, Asmund. What up, boys? You were having a wrestle? Hey, hey what's, what's up, bro? Yeah. How you doing? Yeah. Did you just get back? Yeah, I just got back with Miz. Oh, Miz sure. Miz went and uh, fought some people in Smash at the college campus. Like, the people that went and played, he went yeah. and fought them in Smash. Really? Yeah. That's funny. Did yeah, you win? We did. We won. We actually destroyed. Blue team went crazy. Holy shit. Okay. Crazy. I messed up my knee a bit. Yeah. And my ankle right now is killing me, dude. Yeah. I, like, I sprained my ankle, I think. God damn. That's yeah. nuts. Here, sit down. Yeah, that, that's crazy. Okay. Yeah, y'all had fun with the uh, the little kickball thing and everything. Yeah, we did. Yeah, good that's to see good. you, bro. Yeah, I've just been hanging out. Dude, chilling. we gotta get some barbecue sometime, man. Uh, I know. I wanna try Texas barbecue. Dude, okay. Let's, uh, go to, let's go to Black's Barbecue. Let's in the do future. it on, like, maybe. Uh, I mean, we could always do it on I'm down on Monday whatever. after the show. So what are you guys up to? Uh, I went to the Taco Bell earlier, and uh, let's see. Oh, they got my Light order ice. wrong at Taco Bell. Yeah, you got them right. And uh, mm -hmm. yeah, they got my order wrong at Taco Bell. I know that might come as a surprise, gentlemen, but uh, I went there. Uh, they fucked it up, and uh, we were going to eat in the store, but we couldn't do that because they had the shit closed. And it's like... Uh, it's like you're gonna talk about, oh, it's because of COVID, man. They weren't even wearing masks whenever they got me the food. They want to talk about COVID, man. Fuck that. They just didn't want to open up the diner because they didn't want to clean that shit up. And so that's what's going on over at Taco Bell. There is a certain point where you can take, not necessarily enjoyment, but it's more that you look at somebody who's made a very bad decision with their life mm -hmm. and you can think, thank God it wasn't me. <laughs> thank God I didn't do that. That's just... a very good example with the yeah. tattoo one. That's it. Oh, yeah. Like the tattoo with the gauges, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Like, yeah, like, yeah, age 18 or 19 decisions, man. No regrets, exactly. There you fucking go. Never tattoo like that. I don't have any tattoos. Like, my dad has tattoos. Like, I have plenty of people I know have tattoos. I think that's cool, right? But, like, for me, I just never really had one. I, I, I'm not a tattoo guy. Yeah, I just oh, don't really. Yeah, I, yeah I just, it's, it's not really for me. It's just, yeah, it's cool. I, I, don't, like, I don't mind if other people get them or, like, I think yeah, they look good I'm on not other people. I just don't know what I would even get. Like, yeah. I, I mean, yeah. Well, the thing is, the reason and I'm just why. A pussy. Yeah, yeah. The, the, re <laughs> the real reason why is, like, my friend Toby. Uh, he got a tattoo whenever he was like 16 or 17 and it was like back then like you have like the kids that would get tattoos These are basically the same quality as like jail tattoos, mm -hmm. right? And uh, cuz like, they don't have like any of the good technology and he got a heart with his mom's name on it And he showed his mom and his mom's like what the fuck's wrong? With yeah, you? she's like, pissed. Yeah, <laughs> she's fucking mad. She's like what'd you do to your body? Like this is God's Come body on, that mom. he gave you <laughs> and it's like he put he put it on there a heart for her and she made him take that shit off. And I remember the oh, side of his man. fucking arm was swollen up like this oh, high. Really? Yeah, yeah, it, with like the removal the same, thing. Huh? Uh, I think it probably was better because like he was pretty young, never happened. So yeah. like, I, I think he did recover. And like he had that shit happen and they had to uh, corporate logo on my skin. Yeah, <laughs> I've seen people like that. Like 
there's like always uh, uh, rappers like a uh, riff raff, you know, people like yeah. that. They get like a low and like obviously that one's kind of a meme, but like they get a uh, logos and shit of things tattoos on them, like McDonald's logo yeah. tattoo. Oh my god! It, it's like <laughs> it, 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 it's like don't, and like that's cool, but like they should be paying you for that. I was thinking getting an True. OTK tat. Yeah, yeah. I mean, well, that one's not dumb, right? That's a good decision. No, that, oh, that would be a good yeah, decision. Good, yeah. <laughs> good. Uh, with Chipotle uh, underneath yeah, yeah. it. Yeah. And smoke uh, brisket. Yeah, <laughs> smoke exactly. Brisket. So what are your plans for Season of Mastery? Okay, so I was just talking about it a little bit. Yeah. I think I want to do... I think I should make a video about this. Okay. But I might do... I got my name. I got my character on Obsidian Edge. Okay. Last time I ever played Vanilla WoW... I will do it on Season of Mastery. I'll do it November 16th. And if I die, hardcore Iron Man. If I die, I delete the character and I never play again. I never play vanilla again. Yeah, you die in the game, you die in real life. Yeah. I, also, I also thought about building a robot that will be attached to my, my pants. Yeah. And maybe I don't like delete my character, but instead it'll expose my penis to the stream. Oh. I'll have a, I'll have a crush so game. It's like those so girls. Man. The, well, the, yeah, yeah, exactly. So like... Oh, that's a really good idea. Yeah, you have like a, um, you know, I call like the Soviets had the dead hand. Like if uh, if they got bombed, it would still do nuclear bombs. Yeah, yeah. And, and like this would be like the the dead channel or the dead dick, right? Yeah. And it would just immediately pop out if your character dies. Mutually assured destruction. Yeah, destroy the character, destroy the channel. It's done. Yeah. So I think it'd be good. Do you see all the stuff about patch nine point two? Didn't look at it it's anymore. crazy. I didn't even uh, I didn't even know it was live so, until until like ten minutes before. Yeah. So like basically, uh, they're adding a new zone in the game. Yeah. Uh, it's gonna be a new raid. Okay. So uh, it's also like, the, like <laughs> so yeah, uh, that's pretty much what's happening. <laughs> and uh, Sylvanas uh, is a, still a bitch. Okay. And um, but they gave her a new outfit that makes her hotter. So I think people will be more okay with the Oh yeah, I saw art. that. Yeah, so cause you know, if she's hotter, it's like, all right, you know, it's might as well give her another shot. But that's about it. Like I, oh my god, dude. Yeah. Like, I, I hope that it's gonna be oh, all right, but like retail's got I, I don't think the game like the next time the game will be like good will be like it, in my opinion, I, this is what I think. Yeah. I think that they need to do like a reset. Like they need to Dude, just do like take nuke it. Take That's what I said. Yeah, literally nuke it. Like fucking let Dude, the jailer Azeroth win. Reborn. Yeah, let, yeah, yeah. Imagine that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. A, a realm reborn. Yeah. And uh, as there you fucking go. yeah. And uh, just yeah, delete everything or just like start over again from classic. Like Dude, that's what I would like to see them do. I, what if they do yeah. one more expansion of of. What, here's here's inevitably I think what could happen, another expansion of retail, Wrath Classic, and then they're gonna retell the story from Wrath on, in Wrath Classic, and they're gonna take that over as like the main game. But the problem is, I bet if they do that, they're still gonna blow it. I just I I'm fully confident that they're gonna absolutely blow it. So true because yeah. it's like why would you expect them not to blow it right. it's the same people that are blowing it right now yes and it's like well oh wow what if we have new content i wonder if they're gonna make it any better 